Good night, ladies and gentlemen. This is Chef Frank coming to you on the set. And tonight, we will close out Vegan Week. I am going to make it Burger King's Impossible Whopper. So, tune in right here, right now. It's showtime. All right. Here are our ingredients. You need to make your Burger King's Impossible Whopper. I'll be using Pib, Pib Ridge Farm hamburger buns. Make sure they're sesame seed. And also, I have my Stop and Shops Impossible Burger Patties. They look like burger patties, but it says meat from plants, okay? It, it, it is 19 grams of protein, 7 milligrams of cholesterol, 30% of lead saturated fat in it. And also, it's gluten free, my friends, okay? And also, I have my McCormick hamburger seasoning, my lettuce, tomato. Sliced onions, I'm using Hellman's plant based mayonnaise, my pickles, bread and butter, chip pickles I'm using, and you can, I'm using tomato ketchup as well. Okay, I'll be right back with the first step is when we make the impossible burger patty meat. Okay, we'll be right back. Or right, welcome back to the show, ladies and gentlemen. Now get your impossible burger meat. And then you're going to place it on your griddle. The first one. And now, let me get the second one too. Okay. You see that? That's how it is, my friends. Okay. You let it cook on one side. And then later on, as it cooks, you got... And then you turn over and let it cook on the opposite side. Okay. And then I'll get my hamburger seasoning, and I'm going to season it up, okay? Season up the impossible meat, okay? And um, a few years ago, I did the Burger King Impossible Whopper review on Career Brent a few years back. I'll, I'll link that episode in, this, in the description box below, okay? We'll be right back. We're going to go back to the show. And now it's time for me to flip the first two. And turn them over. And you're going to let that cook. On the opposite side, okay? See, this is this is brown on one side. Now it's gonna get brown on the opposite side. Okay. Make sure you season it the other side too. Okay. We'll be right back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, back to the show. And now I'm going to get my Impossible Burger Patty. Let's put on this bun right here. Then I'm going to get my plant-based mayonnaise and I'm going to spread it all around, okay? Then you're going to, you're going to get your lettuce. And then I'm going to get you, get your tomato and some sliced onion. Okay. You see? Just like that. And then when you're done, you're gonna put it on top like this, okay? And also, you're going to add in, don't forget the pickles as well. See? 
just like that okay we'll be back all right ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the show and now it's time for the taste test right here right now taste test time here we go here we go Mmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -mm. This Impossible Whopper is delicious. Tastes good to perfection, everybody. Real talk, one, two, three. And all that McCoy hamburger seasoning gets it the kick, ladies and gentlemen. All right. This is real as it gets. And it's Chef Brent approved. Yeah, there you have it. That's how you make the best ever Burger King's Impossible Whopper ever done by the one and only Chef Brent Thomas. If I could do it, you could do it, my friends, okay? So they're going to go ahead and burn on this Wednesday, Friday night as always. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe, and click, click on the post game bell next to it. The woman's become Corey Brent. Take care. Enjoy your weekend. Good night. We'll see you on the next episode. Love somebody, hate no one. And Corey Brent runs deep. Good night. See you on the next episode.